Hello, and welcome to part three of CompuDoc's fourth lesson on computer basics. In this lesson, we will go over what a USB drive is and how to use it. Follow along to learn more about USB drives now. Outside of File Explorer and your own computer, there are other common places a document might be saved. One of the most useful and common is called a USB drive. A USB drive is a small stick about one inch long that is an extra source of memory. You may hear the USB drive is also referred to as a flash drive, a memory stick, or a thumb drive. A computer only has a limited amount of storage to save files, videos, pictures, etc. And if you are running low on storage or you want to give someone a file without sending it via the internet, you can use a USB drive. You can download files and video onto a USB drive from your computer and then plug it into another computer to deliver those files. Let's go over how to use a USB drive. If a USB drive is empty and you would like to download a file onto it, find the USB port on your computer and plug the USB drive into it. Remember to be gentle when inserting the USB drive as any aggressive movements could damage the USB port. Once inserted, you should get a pop-up telling you a USB drive has been inserted. It may take a few seconds for the pop-up to load. Once inserted, click on your File Explorer icon. You should see a folder labeled USB drive on the bottom left of your File Explorer. To download a file onto your USB drive, find the file you want to move in its folder, then simply click and hold your cursor over the file and drag it over to the USB drive. When you see the small highlight indicating your cursor is over the USB drive folder, release your finger and the file will be downloaded onto the USB drive. When you are done downloading files onto your USB drive, you must make sure to eject it safely. You can not simply pull the USB drive out of the computer. Doing so without properly ejecting the drive can damage the information on the USB drive. To safely eject your USB drive, find the small upward arrow on the bottom right of your taskbar. Click on it and find the small icon that looks like a USB drive. If you hover over the icon, it should say something similar to safely remove hardware and eject media. Click on this icon, then select the option eject USB drive. Once you do this, you should get a pop-up telling you that it is now safe to remove USB drive. Now you can remove the USB drive for, from your computer without risking the files you just stored on it. If you want to open a file that is downloaded onto a USB drive, first plug the USB drive into your computer's USB port. Once you see the pop-up telling you that a USB drive has been inserted into your computer, go to File Explorer and find the folder with the name for your USB drive. Click on the folder and it will show you all the files located on this drive. From here, you can click on the file to open it or right-click on files and download them onto your computer. Once you are finished, remember to safely eject your USB drive before removing it from your computer so you don't damage any files on it. This concludes Part 3 of CompuDop's fourth lesson on Computer Basics. If you would like to learn more about downloading and using files for things like resumes, presentations, schoolwork, and more, you can open CompuDoc's next series of lessons on tech for your life and business. For now, click on the final part of the fourth lesson to learn about the last few icons on the taskbar. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day.